Inspection stations across Montana are opening up again to prevent the spread of aquatic invasive species. MTN's Jonathan Berrien spoke with Montana Fish, Wildlife and Parks leaders to find out how the program is going. It was a warm Mother's Day weekend at Canyon Ferry Lake, and many people spent the holiday out on the water. Those boaters had to come through Montana Fish, Wildlife and Parks inspection stations. This weekend, FWP opened stations at Canyon Ferry and Tiber Reservoir for the first time this year. This is the third year of increased requirements on boaters in those bodies of water, after tests in 2016 showed the possibility that invasive mussel larvae were there. We've done a lot of advertising and promotion of the clean drain dry message in Montana and the rules and regulations that people need to follow. Uh, so I think we're doing good. Um, we can always do better and we're always working to try to make sure we get to everybody. Boaters are required to stop every time they pass an inspection station. The inspectors check that they've cleaned off their watercraft and drained off any standing water. Boats coming off Canyon Ferry and Tiber have to be washed off with hot water unless they're part of the certified boater program and won't be taken to another body of water. FWP leaders say they aren't making major changes to the inspection program this year, but they have made smaller adjustments. We've adjusted, you know, inspection station locations and hours, you know, to try to be more efficient, to catch more uh, watercraft, to be more available to people. Leaders say they're working to expand testing activities to make sure invasive species aren't found in any other waters around Montana. They say the most important thing is that boaters understand what they can do to help stop the spread. Beyond the regulations, the, the mentality, the, the habit of just every boater, every watercraft user, every time, clean, drain, dry. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News. And before we take a break,